Hello and welcome friends. Index number. Now weighted index number. Yes, and one more case. Uh, this is a very small case, but before starting explanation on this case and solving it, let me remind you that don't forget to like my lectures. Don't forget to subscribe my channel. Do subscribe. Yes, and get notifications. And please recommend my lectures and my channel to all others you know, whether they are students or their parents, your seniors, your juniors. Anyone do suggest my channel. I think my channel is quite useful for anyone who is studying and have these subjects under their syllabus. So please subscribe and recommend my channel and my lectures. Yes, I am trying to do some good activity and your say contribution is just as small as clicking. Just subscribe my channel and recommend. No other thing I am say expecting to get from you people. Just take this as thanksgiving, subscribe and recommend so that many other people can get the benefit of the things what I am trying to give all of the people in the world. Because there is no bar in viewing my channel. According to rules, it may be in under the category these are not for kids, but it is equally useful to everyone who need to learn these things. So don't forget. Yes, thank you. And now I have a small case, but in a board examination, when this question was asked, yes, in board final examination, this question was asked, many students um, confused whether pressure of the examination was the cause or anything and did a mistake a smartly framed question fortunately this was asked for i think two marks only but the small thing which they say either ignored or somehow they forgot to interpret it correctly what is the question what is of the question are the percentage increase in the prices of three items in the question paper, the term was, I think, commodities are 315, 328 and 390. Yes, I am repeating the sentence. The percentage increase. Yes, mark the word increase. The percentage increase in the prices of three items or commodities or things, whatever the case may be, are 315, 328 and 390 respectively. These are not price index number. These are percentage of increase in price. Increase, yes. The price which were in the base year have increased by this much percentages respectively. This is the interpretation. Many of the students mm, ignored the word increase and they took all these as price index numbers and multiplied them by weights and got the general price index. But the whole solution was wrong. Yes. If the importance of these three commodities or items or things are in the ratio 5 is to 7 is to 8, then construct the general price index number. Yes. So it is a tricky question. Just your presence of mind is needed to solve it correctly. At least in the final examination, we can expect that you know how to calculate a simple weighted index number. So, these are the percentage of price increase and we now know very well that while constructing the index number or rather price index number, we know that the prices of the items in the base year are believed or considered to be 100. So these are the increase. So the price index numbers or percentage price relatives can be obtained by adding 100 to all this. This is very small thing, but very important. Otherwise, you cannot construct the correct index number.
Yes. Now we have price index numbers or percentage price relatives of all the three commodities and weights are readily available. How readily available? The relative importance of these things are in the ratio 5 is to 7 is to 8. So this ratio is considered as weight. Okay. The total of weight comes to 20. And now we need only IW. I into W. 415 into 5 will be 2000 plus 75. 428 into 7. Yes, 428 into 7. That comes to 2996. And 490 into 8. First, you take 500 into 8, 4000. Then subtract 10 into 8 from it. So 3920. Yes. And the total comes to 8991. Please confirm. So now we have both the components of the formula of weighted general price index number sigma IW upon sigma W. Yes. General price index number weighted if you don't write W it's okay sigma IW upon sigma W that is 8991 divided by 20 so it is 449.5 Yes, 449.5 5 Ok, let me confirm 8991 divided by 20 Yes Hmm So this is the weighted general price index. But this was the tricky part. This is percentage increase. Yes. Okay. So now I hope you all will be careful while reading the question as well as attempting the solution in your examin in your practice, in your examinations, etc. Again, one more reminder, please don't forget to like my videos, my channel, rather subscribe my channel and recommend this to all people you know. Thank you very much. Take care and wear mask. Don't forget wearing mask.